Uh, I'm Billy Ray Williams. Uh, I live in Fort Valley, Virginia. I was the first one to ever have the focus ultrasound treatment. I had taken medicines for 10 years and uh, it, got, it really got worse. I selected this treatment, uh, focus ultrasound, and uh, I'm happy with it. And when I talked to Dr. Elias, I, I, for some reason I felt confident in him. I, when I went for this procedure that morning, I was not nervous, I was not afraid. In fact, me and my wife, we didn't even really discuss it the night before, you know. I was looking forward to going. To it. it was done a year ago this past February. It's the best thing ever happened to me in 25 years. And uh, the next morning, my wife came up and brought the crossword puzzle. I laid in bed and worked the crossword puzzle, which I which I couldn't do before. I would attempt them, but I, there's no way I could stay in those blocks at the time. But, uh, and then it just, everything was good from, from that point on, you know. Probably three or four months into it, I got a little shaky when I, when I would write, but uh, Dr. Lice told me that some of it may come back. He wasn't sure. And then they gave me some pills put me on medication and, and I'm fine now. It's not totally perfect, but yes, I'm not totally satisfied with it, you know. I'm very, very happy with it. I've been able to tee my own golf ball up. I've been able to eat without shaking my food everywhere. Uh, I can do teacher's work now, which I couldn't do before. Uh, and things like that, small things to most people, but very big things to, ha to have happened to me. It just feels good that, that I know that, that things can be happen to you when you're really shaking bad. My name's Diane Huss. I'm a doctor of physical therapy. I specialize in neurologic conditions, particularly movement disorders. I'm a board certified neurologic physical therapist. And I've had the great good fortune to work with Dr. Elias over the last eight years. Mr. Williams was number one. And he, in, in my experience with him throughout, he, it was very important to him to be the first to do this. He, he um, feels very proud of that, and I'm very proud for him. Um, what we saw was some return of his tremor at the one-year mark, but it was not where it was before his treatment. So it was a little bit of an increase. This is a progressive condition. So um, that's not totally surprising. And the, what we hope and what so far he's experiencing is that in spite of his um, increase in his tremor, he's still totally able to do all of the things that he wants to do. He is able to use medication to help modulate the tremor. So this tremor that was not able to be controlled with medication can now be modulated to the, with less medication and allow him to use his hand to do the things he wants to do. So yes, it has come back a bit, but not a huge amount, and not to the point where it's restricting any of his uh, or causing any disability for him right now.